one of the questions I get asked pretty often is, hey, do I need to incorporate to start a nonprofit? And surprisingly enough, the answer is no. You can also form an unincorporated association. Now, I don't think that's a great option. With an unincorporated, un unincorporated association, you have to have an organizing document of some sort that lays out your rules, your bylaws, who's a member, all that sort of stuff. And it's just as complicated pretty much as starting a corporation. You also need an EIN for it, which you'll need for a corporation. It's, it's just a, almost as complicated as doing a corporation with none of the liability protections because it's still an individual organization. So I recommend you start with a corporation and form a corporation, then get your EIN. Now, do not let someone tell you that you can in, that you can file for a nonprofit status on an LLC because that's simply not correct with one exception. An LLC is basically like an individual, right? And you can't get nonprofit status for yourself as an individual. It's got to be an organization that can be owned by the public. So the one exception is, this is tricky, all right? If the LLC is normally composed of individuals, right? And if the LLC is composed of organizations that are themselves eligible for 501c3 status and only organizations that are eligible. So you might have three members and one is a corporation and two are unincorporated associations and they form an LLC. That LLC could apply for 501c3 status, but not just a regular everyday doing business sort of LLC. Not even if it makes a subchapter sub -chapter S election, which it's just too much of an individual pass through type of organization and can't belong to the public the way a corporation or an unincorporated association can, uh, can be. So if somebody tells you your LLC can be a 501c3, you need to run the other way. I had to unwind one uh, a couple of years back here in Tennessee where a lawyer told them they could do it that way and they did it. And they were operating for years claiming to be a nonprofit, but they were not eligible. So. You definitely don't want to be in that category. I hope that's clear. If you've got any questions, uh, hit me up. Uh, partnership, no, can't be an LLC. So hit me up in the comments if you've got any questions. Hope that clarifies it. For more information on raising money, please go to jdonate.com. See you there.